and welcome to this week's installment of the Lee News Network. I'm Cherry Jo. And I'm Ryan Campbell. Here are today's top stories. The 2015 Vintage Yearbook was revealed last week at the annual yearbook reveal party. A huge shout out to all of those involved with making this year's yearbook happen. You did a great job. We hope everyone out there will be able to get their hands on it. Tell me when. We're on. Okay. Uh, dance Commission announced that there will be an end-of-the-year dance and ice cream social on Friday, May 29th from 6 to 10 p.m. Tickets will go on sale of May 25th for $8 for ASB and $10 without. Additionally, there will be a series of student performance showcases at the ice cream social. Please visit Room 72 for more information if you are interested in participating. Hope to see all of you there. Attention to all students with a driver's license. As of today, any student found parking in the faculty parking lot will be given a $40 citation. Save yourself the trouble and try parking elsewhere. Attention to everyone taking AP Environmental Sciences next year. The summer assignment is available for pickup in room 45. Make sure to get it before finals. Attention to everyone taking a push next year. This Friday in the pack will be an informational meeting with Ms. Nicoletta regarding class expectations, specifics of the course, and any other important questions you may have. Also, summer assignments are available for pickup in room 67. Attention to everyone with a locker. All seniors must turn in their lock by this Thursday. Failure to do so will result in a $5 late fee. Next Monday is locker cleanup day, and we hope all of you will make sure to get their lockers nice and spiffy. And lastly, if you do not know your locker combination, see Mr. Wagster in the attendance office by the end of the week. Come on down to Lee from 6 to 8 this Saturday for the Longhorn Stampede Pasta Feed. For $12 each, you can come and enjoy Caesar salad, French bread, drinks, two kinds of pasta, and dessert. Make sure to stop on by. Lee's online spirit boosters are an easy way to help graduates celebrate their achievements. Place any orders for graduation lays, flyer bouquets, and more before May 31st. You won't want to miss out. May 31st is the third annual Lee Stampede 5K run in which all proceeds will come back to us, the Longhorns. It's a huge event and we will hope that everyone will come to show their spirit and to raise a ton of money for our school. Don't miss out on this awesome event. There will be food, games, perspiration, exhaustion, and much, much more. We hope to see you there. Last week, Zokar Zarnev, the man responsible with the Boston Marathon bombings in 2013, was sentenced to death after a three-month-long trial. While given the death penalty, it is likely Zarnev will spend the next few decades on death row before actually receiving lethal injection. An Amtrak train in Philadelphia crashed last week after going 100 miles per hour. Eight people were killed and two, over 200 passengers were injured. Further investigation is in process over whether or not the engineer deliberately had the train derailed. One of the greatest gang shootouts in American history erupted last week after a fight broke out between five rival gangs in Waco, Texas. Why did the fight break out? To be honest, I don't know. But if I could guess, it was probably a dispute over which gang looked more like the cast of Duck Dynasty. So my name is Ben Davis, uh, and I'm going to be the new weatherman because Ryan was fired after like falling around on the bathroom floor, which is kind of gross. Um, so let's, let's look at the weather for a second. Um, so it looks like Tuesday is going to be sun and clouds. Um, Wednesday is sun. Thursday is also going to be sun. And Friday is going to be sun and clouds. You're going to ask someone about the weather now? Oh, do I do that right yeah. now? Okay, let's go. There's some one over here. Um, excuse me, sir. Can I ask you about the weather? The what? Can I, can I ask you about the weather? The weather? I used to do the weather. Um, sir, are you okay? I am the only weatherman. Bah! Bam! Monday sun, Tuesday clouds, Wednesday sun, Thursday sun, and Friday clouds. Thank you very much. Well, there you have it. That's the news. We hope you guys enjoyed this week's installment of the Lee News Network. Make sure to tune in next week for a special finale episode of the news. You won't want to miss the amazing surprise. So until next time, I'm Ryan Campbell. And I'm Cherry Jones. Have a great day. And stay classy.